we are on a mission today. I want to find whatever these whitetail are. TK something. TK said something in the uh, the official hunter Discord about like heavier whitetail or something. But I don't know what it is. <laughs> All I know is they're supposed to be above like the weight estimate. So I think tracks are going to be a really good thing to actually look for. So. I sat up here for like five minutes before the stream. I was hoping any and all whitetail that are supposed to be here would have made it. That's a big male. I didn't even realize that was over there. Let's go shoot that and then we'll go from there. But his estimate's 85 to 100. So I'm assuming like the estimates and everything are going to be with like the norm. And then whatever special Easter egg should have its own <laughs> unique thing. So... 340 meters for the new M1. We'll see what we can do with that. And Lori, thanks for the super chat. I really appreciate that. That rhymed. Yeet. Did that get vertebrae? And there were actually more whitetail just coming in, but I tried to save the one that we shot. It's a moose. There were a bunch of them. Why did you guys wait so long? He still <laughs> isn't dead, so... Oops. He didn't have the diamond rack. He was, like, just a tick below it. But... He will die. We'll go around this way and hopefully go get him. Nailed my first diamond today. It was a 515 blonde fur mule deer. Nice, dude. Kill an albino... Goose? I don't think geese have an albino variation. Or if they did, I was unaware of it. Do you have a screenshot of that? Would love to see that in the Discord somewhere. What emote is that all the above? Oh, I see. <laughs> well. A hit is a hit. I mean, you know. Brings him down. I'm sure he didn't go too far because I hit him so poorly he will have tried to come back. Yeah, these guys are just going over there. I kind of like the new estimates. If you guys haven't noticed that, the estimates actually are kind of tailored to the specific animal. It's not um, just the like set of three or four estimates. So Whitetail don't just have maybe three total estimates. There's a bunch of them. And depending on the size of the animal, the estimate's going to differ. And I like that. It's kind of cool. Mallard with 7mm. That seems a little aggressive. Shot a 528 mule deer yesterday. Nice. Couple of big males. I wonder if there's a level 4 whitetail now. That's what the hint's making me think. Maybe. I mean, that's something to look for, like, for sure. Hi. Where did you guys come from? I'm 100% going to be looking for any whitetail I can spot that says, you know, anything above 100 kilos is the max estimate. Any track I can pick up that's above the max estimate. And, of course, somebody in the Hunter official Discord, I don't know if you guys saw it, but they got a fabled piebald track, but it ended up just being, like, normal. So I don't know, like, what the deal with that is. Like, it was a different piebald variation. It was kind of like a darker color. But it was, it had normal antlers. It weighed in the 85 to 100 estimate. So I think that was just a bug. Uh, Lori, thanks for the super chat again. And Stefan as well. I appreciate you guys. Where is the blood of that one? Should be like right here. But I don't see it. It's not a huge deal. But I would like to find it just because I assume respawns factor in with this as well. What's up, Brooke? Got two diamond caribou today and one was leucistic. I saw somebody post a diamond albino today as well. That's pretty cool. There's the blood. Yeet. Uh, Pierce, thanks for the super chat as well, man. Been waiting for the stream all weekend. Good luck. Thanks, dude. Are my settings wrong? Or is that just the... Okay. Probably just the alerts. 
they tend to do that. Anyway, we'll go find this thing. Why is that a surprise, Lucky? No understando. I'm sorry. Next track, please. There he is. Okay. Shot a diamond melanistic mallard. I would like one of those, to be honest. I think that'd be really cool. So, yeah, a little bit too high. And then did nothing, but... Like I said, maybe respawns, I don't know. I'm not sure. There's one more day of this Trailblazer beta left. So after that, uh... Any respawns that we're working on are basically useless, but I'll probably come out here one more time and check everything that we've shot, look for anything new. What's up, Ben Ben? Haven't seen you for a couple of streams. Good to see you, man. What do you think was a bigger troll in 949 or 999? I mean, at least 999 was a diamond. <laughs> I think I only got one of those ever, but I was always more disappointed with 949 for sure. Good news is, all this running around, any and all whitetails that were meant to be in zones should be in their zones by now. So that's good. Uh, Mason, thanks for the super chat, man. What animal would you like to see next? I want to see pronghorn. I think they would be so cool. They've nailed true horns on everything they've done. True racks uh, are a little spotty. Every uh, true horn species they've done, I think, looks really good. So I think they could really do well with pronghorn. I want to see it. Best spot and time for mule deer? Uh, I would say like the <laughs> the two sen like the big center lakes on Parque Fernando, and they drink from nine to twelve, so in that area. Uh, Lori, thanks for the super chat again. Do I play hunting sim? I tried the free trial on Steam, didn't like it. I just saw the trailer for Hunting Sim Two. <laughs> I may get it. I may see if I can get my hands on it, just for fun. Check it out. Uh, King Cricket Outdoors, thanks for the super chat as well. Super chat? Super chat. I say things properly. Until he said super chat, though. Where am I at at the map? I am the kind of southwest area heading up this river. And time is 13.18. I'm pretty much... I started at 12.30. Just to hopefully have every whitetail moving into their zone by the time we get to wherever their zone is. We should be all good on that. Hi. Hopefully we can... I want to just see a lot of whitetail today. I want to <laughs> get to as many good spots as we can in maybe an hour. And then I want to go look for melanistic red deer. So I spent the morning running around Quattro Colinas. Because I did check Parque, I didn't find any. But then I realized, like, there's probably none because the pop file never had any on it. But melanistic red deer are supposed to be on this beta. And I was thinking in creating a new pop file by going to Quattro because I'd never been on it for this save file. Maybe that will work. So we're going to check that out as well. <laughs> all right. All the super chats are happening. I'm going to get behind Daniel. They should add turkeys. I kind of agree. I'd like to see it on a different map, though. Like when they add a new map, get turkeys in the game. I think that'd be better than trying to like squish them into Layton or something where it's already crowded. But thanks, man. I appreciate you. Diego, thanks as well. And Whitetail Stunner. Much appreciate. My name is Dating Soul on PS4, and I want to say keep up the good work. I also have an albino Cape Buffalo on my map. Ooh, nice. Somebody, I was in multiplayer the other day. Somebody killed like a, I think it was probably a mythical albino. It was in a place I never checked, so I didn't really feel too upset about that, but I really want one, so that's cool, man. Bring on 1K? Yeah, we're closing in on that pretty quick, aren't we? Would probably be the earliest into a stream we've ever hit a thousand viewers if that happened, like, soon. Kind of crazy. Gonna be so many Melanistic Red Deer kill when they release them. Probably. Somebody I saw on YouTube had two in one herd. So I hope they sort of scale that back a little bit, because that's not right. I mean, I guess it could happen. Hey, JW. Can't stay long, but just wanted to say hey. Well, hey. Good to see you, man. Yours is a 7? Still good, though. Like, as long as it's not, like, a level 5 male, because they look so sad. Any of them look decent. Just spot real quick. 
What if they trolled us super hard? And he said Whitetail, but they meant Whitetail Jackrabbit. I don't think they would do that, but that would be hilarious. My Twitch sub renewed today. Holy. So, new badge, or are you on five months? I think you're on four or five. I'm trying to remember. Accidentally deleted the Melanistic Diamond Ibex. Oh, no. That's big sad. I should do a bear series. I've got a couple of series I have in mind. I think I'm going to start doing a lynx series again. Because I did one a while ago. But I got my diamonds, so... That was pretty good. Um, <laughs> I, I stopped, so I want to do that. I want to get a diamond black bear. I need a diamond brown bear. I want an albino brown bear because those are apparently actually spawning correctly now. Um... What else was I looking for? Diamond Coyote would be good. Something else that I've been planning on, though. Jackal, maybe? There's a couple of areas that I want to check for Jackal. I think it's four or five. You don't even know anymore. Oof. I feel you, though. Gotta head out. Shoes the mails while I'm gone. We'll get him, man. I appreciate you stopping by, though. I really do. What's up, Warzone? Bear down. That's what I should call it. I should call it that. Because the idea is... The idea that I had... Fox is the other one I need, by the way. Not Jackal. But Jackal, too. The idea I had was to kind of start... Like a night hunting slash predator sort of series. Just because... I actually enjoy it. And you get to see a lot of stuff that you don't otherwise see. And sometimes it works. So we'll give it a look. Been a member for eight months? I think you're almost to a new badge, actually. I think there's a... Or is that on Twitch that it's a nine month? I'm actually not sure. Might be Twitch. Uh, Stay Squash. Thanks for the super chat, man. Sorry not been able to watch lately. No worries, dude. Real life comes first. I get that. So do we run this kind of dead chunk? I don't want to, but I know Whitetail will drink in here. And I definitely don't want to go past anything that, you know, is out here. And then we just miss it. So, I think we'll run it. It's not going to take that long, but... I like to jump around quickly. But I did actually set up a couple of tents in Chilo to make that a little quicker. And I think... Yeah. I put one here as well so we can check that like super quick, so... A couple of spots we'll be able to look at like real fast, see if there's anything good. Get out and get to the next spot. I just want to check as many like known whitetail areas as I can. Because they pretty much confirm that. White tail is what we're looking for. Uh, which one of those shut up first thing Daniels did? Thank you, man. They should add dogs for duck hunting. Yes. Dogs for bird hunting in general. I lost a level 4 goose earlier today because I did not spot it. And I have no idea where it landed, so. That was a big sad. Uh. Would be great to have retrievers. Classic has them. They are invaluable at times when you don't know like where all your geese went down at. So that would be good. And uh, Ben, thanks as well, dude. What's going on with Red Deer? The Melanistic Red Deer, they are finally spawning correctly, apparently, on this Trailblazer beta. So we're going to spend probably close to half the stream looking for them. Yeah, this is why I didn't want to uh, just yeet away. There are Whitetail that drink along here, just not a ton. But they all seem to be... Well, that's a good one, but they all seem to be quite normal. Holy... Okay, I was looking at chat. I didn't realize I was going to step on wabbits. That sound needs to turn down. Like, I realize you want to be able to hear them, but that's a little bit noisy. Yeah, none of these are special. There's another one coming, though. Lots of them here. Holy. Guess I should take back what I said about not many. Uh. Hey, Safe Squash, thanks for the super chat again, man. Should start a hunting podcast? I would probably like to at some point. We'll see. Kind of got a lot on my plate at the moment, so maybe sometime in the future. Those are does. I mean, I guess I can cross near enough to hear that it's worth trying to get a couple of these. The biggest one's hidden. So we're going to try to drop this front one if we can. And then get 
the one that's behind him. Probably gonna mess it up, but I'm gonna try to heart shot him. Any day now. There you go. That was effective. So many people. Oh, hey, we're over a thousand. <laughs> yeah, I see that, Lucky. Nice. Yeah, I think that's going to be the fastest a stream has ever reached a thousand viewers. So, uh, breaking records while we're out here on quarantine. I appreciate you guys. Can we get the eggs if we're on console? Unfortunately, the Trailblazer beta is only on PC. Uh, the reason isn't anything like against console players. I think they'd probably prefer to be able to have like a console beta, but it's difficult working with Sony and Microsoft to have betas and then roll them back and everything. So it's not really an option at the moment. What gun is that? This is the M1. It's in the Smoke and Barrels weapon pack. It's the newest weapon pack released. It's quite nice. It does have a pretty serious recoil to it, but if you can manage that... Really good for quick follow-up shots. Hi there. So the new, uh... The new deer warning call. I don't know what I think about it. It's like... It sounds like a snort wheeze. Not a proper... Like, snort. So I don't know. It's kind of weird. Anyway. Keep on heading across here. Uh. Xbox doesn't get the love it deserves. You right. It's a sad day. Uh, is it SpeedX? I'm not sure how to say your name, but thanks for the super chat. Been playing Call of the Wild for about six months now. Still haven't gotten a diamond. What am I doing wrong? I played for about eight months till I got one, so I wouldn't say it's like odd or out of the ordinary for you to not have one yet. But the thing that kind of really propelled the amount of diamonds I found, number one was the amount of hours I was putting in. The more I started to enjoy the game, the more I played and the more you know, naturally I would get lucky every now and then and come across something. But, um, hunting by water. I spent so much time looking for diamonds in the past. I would, like, try to go through fields and brush and stuff, and I thought maybe they were hiding in that. It's just drink zones. Just hunt near water, hunt drink zones, and you'll find stuff. Like, you will. Maybe not in the first day, maybe not the first week, but... You'll eventually start finding stuff, and the more you get the hang of it, uh, the more you'll find. I can promise you that much. That's actually kind of a good-looking whitetail. I like that. Uh, Lori, thanks again. Much appreciate. This was that bigger one that was in there. And Warzone, thanks again as well. Love your vids so much. Now I... I now play the hunter. That's awesome, man. I'm glad. 18 whitetail in one herd. You don't see that much anymore. Uh, Used to be a thing all the time. I kind of like that, but it's good that they're spread out as well. Um, Pierce, thank you again, man. Is Belmont Lake good for whitetail? Also, are blacktails broken 93 kg troll yesterday? They say they're not broken. They say that it's just the new system and the levels don't matter. I don't know how much I completely believe that, but the blacktails that are making diamonds are the ones with the really funky racks. So if you see a really messed up looking blacktail, shoot that one because it's probably a diamond. It's got to be a four but those are the ones. Uh, Belmont Lake for Whitetails. Sometimes, <laughs> depends on the server. I've never killed a really big one there, but <laughs> it can be. There's a decent buck. Another buck back in there. We'll get a little closer, see if we can get them both, because there's a crossing right here. Oh, Spid X. I gotcha. Sorry about that. And thanks for the tips, we'll definitely do that. Yeah, hopefully that works for you, man. I mean, like I said, hours is the probably the biggest thing. You can tell just through my videos how much I'm grinding the game. Because if there's a diamond in like every single video every day, then I'm probably playing a lot. If there's not, I'm probably really only playing when I record. But, yeah, both of those things can be kind of factored in, I guess. The fact that the fox I shot yesterday makes me think weight doesn't matter. Well, I don't... For fox, it's always been a little bit weird, as far as I know. But I don't think the fox have been touched by the new scoring system very much anyway. 
Like, I'm pretty sure that's really only a true rack thing. This is gonna be tough. If I want to get both of those bucks, we're gonna have to really think about this. Maybe if he steps out there, it'll be a little easier. Okay. Well then, just make my life way easier, why don't you? We're gonna kill the not broadside one first. Now they're both <laughs> not broadside, but whatever. That guy's dead. And this guy didn't get as good as I thought. I should take care of that. I missed a thing. Hey, Danny, what's up, man? <laughs> Thanks for the super chat. Runaki run and whitetail spots. White's bugged. I'm missing something there. Slightly not understanding what you're asking me. I appreciate you nonetheless, though. And Warzone, thanks again. Your vids make my day. Well, I'm glad, man. Hearing stuff like that makes my day, so... <laughs> Works out. Oh, I was supposed to remind you that, Brooke. I'm glad you remembered, because... Kind of... No brain. Dream map for a future reserve? I want, like, a... Midwestern U.S. kind of thing with pronghorn, mule deer, uh, let's see. You could do coyote. I'd like to have elk there. Like, there's a ton of options, but pronghorn's the main one I want, and mule deer done right, because the mule deer in the game now are kind of meh. Shot too far back on that follow up, to be honest. And I didn't pay attention to where he got to either. Uh, Sasquatch, thanks again, man. If it's okay, I'll start posting Flinter memes on the fan page. Yeah, you can, man. Ain't gonna bother me. You want Arizona? Yeah, something like that could work. I didn't even realize he was dead here. That was luck. Yeah, a little too far back. That's alright, though. Like I said, respawns. I'll come back here, run through here one more time before the beta's over, hopefully. I don't know why that super chat didn't come up from uh, Spedex again, but thank you, man. Always like to see the stickers in chat as well. Messed up a level 5 elk, but it wouldn't make diamond anyway. Yeah, none of the level 5 elk make diamond right now. I don't think any elk, period, make diamond. I don't know. The way they judge them makes no sense. They gotta lower the requirement or something because it's kind of sad. Can you show the Renaki run of whitetail spots on the map? And are whitetails bugged? They're less bugged. But they still are, I think. Uh. I mean, I say bugged. I don't know if that's the right term. They're just odd, I guess. But, like, if I'm starting down here, basically, if you just look at that, anywhere there's hunting pressure, that's where their zones are. It's pretty much what I would just look at. Uh, if I uh. were you. I don't see them over here very often. That's kind of neat, but they're small. Um, we got Tyler with the super chat. Thank you, man. I've been playing ever since it came out on PS4 and still don't have a diamond whitetail. It took me a long time. They're a little more common now than they used to be. And a lot of level 2s are making it where 3s aren't. <laughs> but, yeah, they're they're one of the less common ones. Um, How do I say your name? Very sovereign. I'm probably saying that completely wrong, but thanks for the super chat. I really appreciate you. Bet you can't pronounce my name well. <laughs> you are correct. Uh, but you've really helped me out in, in many different ways, and I love your vids, so thanks. My pleasure, man. I'm glad that uh, the vids and whatever it has been has been helpful. Uh. But, uh, yeah, sorry, sorry, I can't pronounce your name. Uh, Warzone, thank you again, man. And Jeff, thanks for the super chat. Got my first diamond yesterday, 311 trophy moose. 311s, really up there. That's a big one, man. Congrats. Did FedEx becoming a member show up in the alerts? I don't know if it's going to because sometimes it doesn't like you. But I appreciate you, man. 
Uh, make sure you join the Discord and link your YouTube to your Discord to get the uh, YouTube member role in there because it gives you access to a couple of things. I really appreciate that, dude. Enjoy the uh, emojis in here as well. I don't exactly remember what the viewer record is, but we're really close. I saw 1244 there for a minute. We might have broken it. It's in the 1200s. But again, I appreciate everybody coming out. And I appreciate Fat Guy for the super chat. Thank you, man. Okay, we gotta go... About one and a half kilometers. It's already almost 1500. The time passes so fast. Max weight. Blacktail passed all the checks. Yep. The only blacktail that are making diamond are the really wonky ones. And the reason is because it increases their spread a bunch. They need to... They should lower the requirement for diamond white uh, blacktail to about 195, I would say. But they haven't done that yet. They have not done that in the beta. So, not yet. Are you turkey hunting this year? And if so, you should make a video on it. I'm planning to. Um, I would say I'm not as good a turkey hunter as I am a deer hunter. So there is a chance I never see a turkey. And if so, I probably won't make any videos. Cause I, <laughs> like if I get turkeys on film and don't kill any, I can make a video of that for sure. But if I don't even see any, I likely won't make videos. So we'll see what happens. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have my camera with me. I can tell you that. Uh, holy super chats, guys. I really appreciate you. Warzone, thanks again, man. How do I link uh, your YouTube to your Discord? So if you're in the Discord, you got to be in my server already. Um, I guess you don't have to be, but you won't get the role unless you're in my server. But in my Discord, there's an info, uh, like text chat at the top. If you click on that, it gives you the exact instructions on how to do it. Um, so I would just do that. It's going to be a little easier than me trying to explain it offhand and not being in Discord. Uh, I think I missed Mav Dog Bros. Appreciate you, man. And Surge, thank you as well. Yesterday I shoosted two diamond moose in a row. They were huge, and also my friend shot an albino <laughs> moose. Okay, that's really cool. I can't say I've ever had a rare moose in with a diamond, though I have had a rare diamond moose. That was a thing one time. But that's awesome, man. And Dream. Is it Dreamia? Hopefully I'm saying that right. Thanks for the super chat. Good luck. I appreciate you. I really do. Hopefully we can have the lux and figure out what this easter egg is. I'd love to do that on stream. That would be really neat. Perhaps the link twitch to your discord should be a command? Like the instructions on it? it would be kind of like a large block of text in the chat if you mean for in the stream chat. Yesterday you got an albino bull moose. I want to get another rare moose. I shot an albino when Truax came out. But he's in like my old, old lodge because that was the old system. I need me a new one. Boy, what's up, Vector? How's your conquest of life going? Do I use the backpack? No. Uh, they make way too much noise. It's really not worth it. Would absolutely recommend ditching any and all backpacks that you may have <laughs> they're just the only thing i use them for is if i'm setting up my map if i'm bringing tents around and even then generally i'll just carry one gun and the tent because i don't like i don't like the noise it spooks animals from so far away it's ridiculous uh jay thanks man thick tail deer time we're trying to find those thick tail deer shot a couple of pretty nice ones but nothing out of the ordinary Going out hunting here soon myself. Just waiting for it to dry out so I can get to where I like to hunt. Ooh, nice. I always like turkey hunting in the rain. Hit a field and wait for them to come dry out. Usually effective. Trying to pick up every check. Look for any that say basically above 85 to 100. That's what it sounds like we need to look for. Uh, Colt, thanks for the super chat, man. Appreciate you. Hi. Hi. Just got a diamond melanistic puma. Ooh, post that in the uh, in the Discord, man. I want to seize it. By playing multiplayer, do you get more diamonds? Not necessarily. 
Um, sometimes yes, sometimes no. It comes down to luck, essentially. And being in the right place and, quite honestly, being on a server where maybe the host has never gone to that lake. Or that area where you're finding stuff. I'm gonna make a video, nah. like, talking about why I play multiplayer. I don't know if I'll do it this week. Like, I've already got plans for several videos this week. At least, I think, three. So, we're already running out of time for that. But, eventually I'm gonna make one just to explain why I do it. What kind of advantages and disadvantages there are and all that stuff. And hopefully clear that kind of thing up. Because that's a, that's a common question. Uh, it's fine, you can't pronounce my name. Nobody's gotten it correct anyways. But one more thing, I got a level 4 diamond leucistic caraboon. A lot more. Ooh. That's awesome, man. Did it have the, uh... Did it have, like, a cool antler shape? Because I've been looking for a level 4 diamond one. The fact that it's leucistic as well, that's just... Huge bonus, but... That's awesome, man. <laughs> if I say very, am I pronouncing the first half of your name right? Because maybe I can just call you that. And Luke. Thanks, man. Huge fan, just got my first diamond. What'd you get, dude? I'm gonna guess diamond mule deer. But thanks for the super chat. Hi. Get out of here. I'm making enough noise. Yeah, I don't really like the snort wheeze warning call. It's no bueno. Got Mises. I'm waiting for alerts to happen. Are there turkeys? No turkeys. No turkeys. It is not a thing. <laughs> well, these guys look very average, I would say. Eh, there's more. Maybe more will come out of the trees while we run over there. Uh, Lone Wolf Kendrick, thanks for the super chat, man. Your videos always make my day do what you do. I got no intentions of stopping, man. I really enjoy it, but thanks. That kind of... Like I said earlier, that kind of comment makes my day, so I appreciate that. Okay, we are end of whitetail drink time, so I don't see any reason. Hi. Let's just get the gun, because I don't know what's coming through here. I don't see any reason to rush trying to kill these ones. I think we'll go ahead and get them, and then we'll actually reset the time and check some of the other areas. think yeah it's those two that we want <laughs> two for two got a diamond gray puma and an albino mythical cape buffalo I want an albino male cape buffalo I think I've only had leucistic anyway they've both been females Going out the 25th to do some fishing, hog, and turkey hunting. Hopefully I can get to where I want to. Yeah, that would be good, man. Jared Baffert finally made it to a stream. Glad you could make it, man. Been a pretty interesting one so far. We've been kind of just chasing down all kinds of whitetail and hoping to find big males. We had one big one that I slightly messed up. Look how nice and friendly they are, though. Take picture. <laughs> How nice. Think double heart shot? Yeah. Not too bad. And let's see. What's the furthest run that we gotta make? Uh. Let's actually do this area. Because I haven't done that on the beta at all. We'll reset the time and hopefully that'll give them enough time to get in there. Kind of got right for my name, and yeah, it had two paddles to try to show you on Discord and the other stuff. Sounds awesome, man. Kind of right, yeah. I can, I can definitely pronounce that part then, so at least you know who I'm talking to, but thank you, man. No taxes on YouTube? You right. You right, sir. We're going to go to like 1245 because I want to hop to Quattro for the second half of this. Okay. Head down to the bridge. But I like camoy. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but yes. They're like mountain goats that aren't mountain goats, so absolutely. Uh, I think BC... I don't know if that's for the win, FDW, either way. I think his came out first. 
vids making lockdown so much more enjoyable. Uh, nah. well, first off, I appreciate that. I'm, I'm glad they do. Any advice on taking down high-level male elk? Also trying to join Discord, but it says unrecognized. Hmm. Try the Discord command in chat, see if that works. And if that doesn't... Like, I know the link will work. But... Nah. If not, maybe if you're in, like, the Hunter Official, you can PM me from there, and I can get you a link. One of the mods can probably get you one as well. We can get you in there one way or another, but I appreciate you nonetheless. Lucky, thanks as well. I don't have to pay your rent if I let you borrow my mount. Yes. We can do that. If I can... <laughs> Every Meat Hunter's video, Lucky, I'm going to stand beside your mount and act like I shot that, and then you don't have to pay rent. Um, and then Mavdog, thanks as well, man. You have a YouTube channel? That's awesome, man. My brother's here. Help. Holy. We're at 1,260 viewers. I think that is, in fact, the viewer record for this channel. So, again, thanks to everybody that's actually here watching this. I really appreciate you. You can just use the cinematic tool to find it. To find what? Oh, the deer. Probably. <laughs> Whatever the white-tailed deer thing is. Can we see it, though? I don't even think the cinematic tool is working because I've used it for thumbnails, like, obviously. I'm pretty sure that's pretty well known. But I tried to make a thumbnail for... What did I do it for? One of the most recent videos, and it wouldn't even open, so I don't think that's an effective method at the moment. Even if you wanted to. Been trying to make it to a stream and I finally made it, but I got my first diamond cutie yesterday. Sweet. I like the cutie, man. That's awesome. They look cool. Heh. <laughs> Jeez. I'm too uh. fat. I ate too much for Easter. Usually there's bears and stuff here, especially when you just change the time. A lot of stuff paths like this area to get to where they're going, so... That's actually something, um, <laughs> it's gonna happen in a video this week. One effective method of, like, hunting things that you maybe aren't specifically looking for is to just change the time and then go hunt crossings and stuff. Because a lot of animals just kind of come out of their zones and then go to those kinds of areas. Still more? Up there. Yeah, whatever. Got two of them. What's up, Gary? You get anything figured out with that stuff from earlier, or not really? Great job on the vids. I really enjoy watching you keep it up. I'll certainly do my best, man. I appreciate you. No deers so far. I remember when rabbits came out, the only thing I could really do was run down here and spook them out onto the crossing. I couldn't figure out how to get them otherwise. And now I don't think they path that way. I think they stay on this side. I am eating sandwich. Holy. Make me one. <laughs> it seems worse. Uh, I, I won't say anything on the stream because I don't want to have information that you don't want anybody knowing. I don't think you would care, but we'll just not say that, and I'll talk to you about it later. But yeah, that's... Uh. There's a concern because of things that are happening. Anyway, I'll talk to you about that later. It's not... Not... Uh, super dire information. Graham, thanks for the Super Jam, man. Good thing Flinter Streams, no work is killing me. I kind of get that. I've been uh, slowly going insane being kind of stuck inside, but... I have to be self-quarantining for two more days to get to two weeks since I was on the airplane. And Nyok, thanks for the super chat as well. Have you tried at home taxidermy? Sort of. My seven point that I killed when I was uh, 15, I think. Ooh, that's a big two. Let's shoot that. I did like a... um. What are they called? An arrowhead black. So I don't know how much that counts as self tax army, but that kind of stuff I've done. And my brother does European mounts. He has a little kind of business with it. 
Am I having floating roads on Hirschfelden? I haven't seen that. <laughs> There's screenshots everywhere. I think Zaggy did a video on it, and I'm over here like, yep, I haven't seen it. But I also haven't looked. If quarantine would have happened during duck season, I'd be fine, isolated in the water. Yeah, there you go. I mean, turkey season here starts in... I think it's two weeks from this Saturday. And our fishing season apparently opened early, but I haven't. Haven't been out. I might actually do that, though. I want to get a new trout rod. I definitely need a new reel, because the reel I have is really bad. But, might go anyway. Will Call of the Wild be released to mobile? They have a different game that they're working on. Um, it's not Call of the Wild, it's a different hunting game. But I think they have their, their branding on it. 1300 viewers, we're definitely breaking records now. If I know someone on Discord is abusing a glitch, what should I do? Uh, PM a moderator and let them know about it would be probably the ideal thing. Are they promoting it or are they just abusing it and not telling anybody? Because if they're just using it, there's nothing we can do about that. Have I been fishing illegally? Have you? I don't know. Big mail. That's point two away from diamond. I've seen, like, in the old system, 949 level 2 rabbits, so I think they, like ducks, can actually make diamond at level 2, but I also can't say I've ever seen one. Promoting it to people in the game? If they're, if they're using Discord to promote it, that's the issue. If they're not, then we can't do anything to stop that. Should go mule deer hunting in New Mexico? I think I'd like to. That sounds fun. What's the Easter egg? We don't know. We're trying to find it. The most recent hint from TK was we're looking for whitetail that are above the max weight. So we're going to spend the next 15 minutes uh, continuing to look for whitetail. And then we're probably going to try looking for melanistic red deer because they're a part of this little update as well. It would be nice if we just get one really quickly. Then we can come back and look for... Uh, Look for whitetail again, but we'll see. PA has seasons on fishing? Oh, yeah. It's actually not seasons on fishing. It's seasons on keeping. But our rivers and streams <laughs> and creeks are all stocked. And that's about the only time you're really going to have decent trout fishing. He can fly fish. The only time you can have decent spin fishing is right when they get stocked and during the seasons. Okay, uh, we'll check here first, too, just because it's a less common spot to see them. Uh, Slurge, thanks for the super chat. My computer just shut off and my game says corrupted game file. What should I do? Uh, gosh, I'm not sure if there's any saving that. Have you backed up your save file ever? Because that's a thing that I highly recommend for all PC players. You can just copy your save file and... If you ever would have something like that happen. Like, I back out my save file maybe once a week. Just in case. So I don't lose progress, but... If you haven't backed it up, I don't think there's really much of anything you can do, unfortunately. Like, not that I'm aware of. Maybe there's some solution out there. Oh. Useful for that to be right in front of me. And now we have a run. Talking about bass fishing. Don't have much trout down here. I mean, we have bass seasons as well. I think bass season's June to... No, wait. To end in June? To start in June? They spawn in June. That's the only thing I care about because I don't keep them anyway. But yeah, our season isn't when you can fish. It's when you can keep them. I think, though, you might not be allowed to fish for trout once they're stocked. Yeah, definitely. You can't fish for trout once they're stocked until the season opens. Was that a black tail? Yeah, I was taking a drink. Yep, don't need to worry about it. 
Uh, are you familiar with the Lackawanna River? Never heard of it. Buddy of mine said that the game wardens are enforcing the social distancing thing and finding people who are too close to each other. That's crazy. I mean, I guess they're just doing their job, but man. But no, I don't even know where that is. Should try to set up a blind and wait. I've kind of done that with a diamond elk before. Um, I knew where he drank, so I set up a blind to catch his path from rest zone to drink zone and shot him on the way there. It was pretty cool. I enjoyed it. Really enjoy your videos. Just found them. Does spine shots still work? Uh, no, spine shots are not the way to go in this game anymore. That was changed a little over a year ago now, actually. Um, lung shots. All you need to do is hit a lung. There's no quick kill bonus anymore. You don't need to worry about dropping them within eight seconds. If you hit a lung, you're all set. Much simpler for pretty much everybody to understand, I would say, so that's a good thing. Okay, here's how we're going to do this. We're going to fast travel here first, and I'm going to show you a thing. If you've never seen this, I've showed this before. It's it's quite interesting. Oh, do you have to get tested, Brooke? Oh, boy. That's fun. But if we, uh, if we fast travel to a tent that's in an area where other animals are, they won't spawn. And I can't even promise there's going to be any here, but there usually are, so hopefully I can show you. But a whole lot of nothing along this coast. Coast, I guess. Edge of water. Hopefully, we fast travel over here. Oh, there's rabbits. But maybe there's no whitetail. There's rabbits that weren't there. I was hoping there were going to be some whitetail. There's another big two. Two of them. Jeez. Yeah, we'll get them. Hopefully get them. How? <laughs> I don't know where I shot around that, but okay. Come on. Wait. Where did the one I want go? He disappeared. Do you go that way? Oh well, they're level twos. Um, so I guess we'll maybe go back to that spot. Usually there's whitetail there. I don't tend to go there when they're not. Quartz must be really making us sandwiches. Quartz is a good guy. Of course he is. Why would he not be? Ooh. Uh. Let's say there's a chance with that one. That's an 85 to 100. Mm. That's an 85 to 100. It's at least three that I want to get. I don't know how I'm going to manage that. Still more deer walking this way, too. Uh, Tyler, thanks for the super chat, man. Always appreciate it. Bunny's hopping over there. Okay. We'll see if we can manage to get these two. And then I'm thinking this guy may get stuck. Yeah, where's he at? I think we got him. Yeah. And... That one. Not too bad. Nobody else interesting. Not really. Nine legendary white tail. I didn't spot one of those, did I? I wasn't really looking at the levels. I was looking at the antlers. I don't think that came fast enough. Zaggy didn't find a 105 kg whitetail. Did they say 105 is the number to look for? I know they said it was like above 100, but I wasn't aware there was a 105. Do we need to have consecutive harvest? Uh, no. The only thing consecutive harvest affects now 
is the cash and XP out you get from kills. Doesn't affect your total score. Lockdown means Minecraft all night? Yeah. I mean, I've never played it, but yeah. Kind of big male. Same as the one we shot at the beginning of the stream. I did not find the Easter egg. Okay. I don't think anybody told me that I did not spot a nine legendary whitetail. I thought maybe I did because of that question, but I, I think the delay in the stream was too fast. It shouldn't have happened yet, so I think that was just a random question. But if they're thick ones, like, maybe. Some people were talking about that before as being the potential addition. But I don't think I saw that. I think I'd have noticed it at least. Like, surely it would be visibly bigger. No whitetail here. They're usually really easy to find if they're in this spot. Uh. I don't see any. Uh, Kenny, thanks for the super chat, man. Ooh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to read that entire thing. I may have to tab out to do that, so... One sec. Let me fast travel to... Our next spot, which is going to be up here. I can read most of it. I enjoy your vids a lot. What area of Layton is your favorite whitetail spot? Also, my friend got this game three days three days ago and got his first diamond moose within... Can I read the rest of this? I can repeat it. Uh. Can I make this bigger for a second so I can actually read that? Within an hour, I helped him get it. Oh, doesn't that figure? It's the way it usually goes. But thank you, man. I appreciate you. Okay. We back in game. So I want to check a little bit of Calburn. I shot that. The only diamond white tail I have in my lodge, I shot like right here. So we'll check that. I got a tent to go to. Um, I think that's going to be all the spots. We'll probably check here again just to see. And then we'll pretty much be pretty much set to uh, head to Quattro and look for Melanistic Red Deer. How are we at 1,400 viewers? Holy guys. <laughs> Thank you for, uh, for stopping by. I appreciate it. What perk is the non-exact zeroing? Non-exact. Um, what do you mean by that? Your voice is quiet compared to the game sound in alerts, is it? Everything's normal, I think my... Everything should be fine. We are actually peaking a little higher than I would expect to. They did change some audio stuff in this beta, so it could be that the game sound's actually just louder. We need a rate? Yeah, I, I got you. <laughs> For real. What's a 9 legendary whitetail? I think that was just like somebody guessing that's what the easter egg is but I thought maybe I spotted one by accident because it was like when I was spotting whitetail and I didn't pay attention nothing else to do except watch your stream everybody's quarantine I get that but still it's cool to see everybody here the tongue clicky yes do more tongue clicky if I figure out what this easter egg is. That ain't working right now though. I'm a big fan. I watch all your videos. Well, I appreciate you, man. That is uh, a lot more support than you might realize. Uh. So, thank you. Um, T-Shop Bandit, thanks for the super chat, dude. Much appreciate. I don't know if there's a coyote or a rabbit. Like, I swear I can hear tiny little footsteps. Maybe not. No, I do. Aha. Uh -huh. I knew there was. Okay. Well, the one other spot that I've been finding whitetail is up by this tent. Do more tongue clicky. We gotta find stuff, though. A decent buck. 
Bite the ducks. Small males. Huh. Wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's another decent one behind that. Blacktail feeding. And I know they also will drink back this way, so let's check that before we do any shooting. You found ducks? Yes. That counts. Okay. Nothing special. I want to... Kill... No, he's not 85 to 100. Is it really worth it, then? I guess. We'll try to get him quick. They're far away. Probably messed it up, but... See what happens. That guy... Ooh, got that next shot. And the hard shot. Okay. That's pretty good. That dude's just chilling. Double lung, I think. Probably gonna mess it up, he says. Okay, I'll just stop downing myself then. Uh, very thanks for the super chat. Oh, he asked for my favorite white tail spot. Sorry about that, man. I got all caught up in trying to read the <laughs> entire message. Yeah, my favorite spot probably lately has been this lake, where we just were a little bit ago. I've seen three level three white tail there. They've all been golds, but <laughs> they've been there. And uh, Trix Clan, thanks for the super chat as well, man. And hey, Barry, I appreciate you uh, pointing that out, because I totally did miss, <laughs> miss that. What's the deal with the Easter egg? They have said that there's an Easter egg in the Trailblazer beta. Nobody knows what it is. Apparently it's really rare. And they've kind of been hinting at it slowly, somewhat on purpose, somewhat by accident. So we know there's like a new, like, metal, which is called Great One. It seems that's being placed on things that are the max score. So... They've also said that's a bug. So I don't know where it's supposed to be. It's probably on these whitetail things, but that's the other thing. So then we found out through apparently another bug that there is a fabled piebald skin or something, fur type. But apparently that was a bug. So basically where we're at is there are some sort of fabled piebald whitetail out there. And the hint that's not a bug that TK gave us is that apparently we're looking for whitetail that are above the max weight. So above 100 kilos. I don't know. I guess maybe the Fabled Piebald's related. Maybe it's not. The great one I assume is meant to go with that. But it's all kind of guesswork. We don't know uh, specifics. There shouldn't be max scores. There shouldn't be, but there kind of has to be. Because <laughs> it's a game difficult to to work with if there's not a max but yeah we're gonna have the quattro we're gonna try looking for melanistic red deer because that is another um, part of this trailblazer beta And we're going to have to change the time because Red Deer, no Drinko right now. Let's go 522. And we're going to go to a place that is a bit of a run. What's the furthest we got to run? Let's do this spot. I don't think I have this outpost on my main save, by the way. Next update's gonna be thin tailed deer, and you're looking for underweight animals. That was a feature last year. Yeah, when they were weighing negative. Quartzite silver sandwich. Rude. I should have grabbed the red deer call. That's alright. Light tailed deer. That does. That just makes more sense.
which I do when Call of Wild's super laggy and my graphics on low. Try turning down the resolution is about all you can do. Or upgrade your PC, of course, but I realize that's a costly one. How to get a diamond? I mean, it's a little more difficult to explain than it used to be. Uh, essentially, every animal in the game has a trophy rating threshold that you have to cross. And if their trophy rating is above that, and you pass all four harvest checks, you'll get a diamond. That's another video I'm going to work on, hopefully, in the next week or two. Is like, explaining what diamond is, how to get it, how to pass all the harvest checks, all that good stuff. Soon. Soon I'll have an actual video. But yeah, it's just basically the biggest animal, biggest... I don't want to say the biggest animal for every species because it's not, it doesn't have to be a perfect animal, but it's got to be like in the top percentile kind of thing. What maps are free for single player? Leighton and Hirschfelden are the free ones. You can play all the others in multiplayer for free. I think you know that from the way you worded it, but just in case anybody doesn't know. If you don't know what map to buy, try them in multiplayer. Go to multiplayer, try them out. Find which ones you like and maybe buy those. Do I have truck sim? Nah, I don't think that's my kind of game. Um, reason? I realize that it's not real. Uh, but driving in like crowded areas in real life just is big stress for me. So I don't think that's what I want to get myself into. White tailor rugby deer and mule deer are cooler in real life. If that's the case, they certainly got it backwards in Call of the Wild. I like white tail in real life, though. Medved's included in the 2019 edition. Yeah, I guess it depends what you buy, because if you buy just the base game, the only two maps there are Leighton and Hirschfelden. If you buy the 2019 edition, yeah, Medved's there. Shouldn't Verhunga be there? I think so. Or wait. Yeah, should be. Maybe that's the 2020 edition. I don't know. What is melanistic? Uh, the simple explanation is animals that essentially are mostly black. Or like darker, I guess. I don't think they necessarily have to be black in color. I think they can be sort of like a dark brown. But what it is in real life is just a... Like... They have too much melanin, I believe, the chemical's called. And it just causes all of their fur... Or oh, What was that? That's a piebald something. It's a roe deer. Causes all their fur to be darker than it's supposed to be. Did we get it? We hit it. Did it run down over the hill? Naturally, I would find that in the beta, but I guess it's a female, so I don't mind too much. That will kill it, because I did that the other day. Shot a roe deer just like that, messed up the next shot, and it uh, it died. So, if nothing else, it gives the potential red deer that drink here some time to show up. All the species on Quattro, there are four species of Ibex. There's Bethides, Grados... Uh, Ronda and Southeastern. There are Mouflon, Iberian Wolves, the Roe Deer, of course, that we just shot, Red Deer, and Wild Boar. I think I got them all. Nope, I didn't because I missed European Hare. Now I think I got them all. Where is the... I don't even see blood. There it is. Ain't dead yet, but it will die. Can promise you that it will. Jack says hi. Hi, Jax. Wait. Ah. What do I have? Mm, this is my best choice. Hopefully he tilted his head. Uh, Snakehead, thanks for the super chat, man. If they put in animals that score higher than diamond, how rare do you think they should be? 
my opinion, somewhere in the area of rare fur type diamond rarity. Like, they should be very, very special. It shouldn't be a thing that everybody gets one two weeks in, you know? At least that's how I'd like to see it. I knew I heard something. He totally did? Good. <laughs> Would be sad if he didn't. Best place to hunt on Quattro, if you ask me, is the top right two lakes. They might be good evidence of this. Yeah, these two. Favorite lakes on the entire map. Red deer, roe deer, mouflon, wolves. Uh, I think... Rabbits at the other one, not this one. And boar at the other one. I don't know about this one. It's a good spot, though. Both of them are. Uh, do you think there should be one free trophy lodge because we paid for tr a trophy hunting game? I mean, not necessarily because, like, when the game came out, there was no... It wasn't a thing. Like, they had to put in a bunch more work to develop it. And, I mean, ultimately, my... Uh, my stance on like DLCs and like paying for content and all that is if you want the game to continue to grow and continue to be developed, continue to have features added to it, you have to support the developers. Like, because the only thing they're getting revenue from is sales of the game, if not. So I'm happy to support like any sort of new development by buying the DLCs. That's kind of the, uh, the stance I take on it. This lake's bigger than I realized. <laughs> it's gonna take a while to get over here to where we can even see anything else. And generally I see red deer on that shore right there, so. We see. Muzzleloader is glitching out? How's that? What's up, Aaron? You know, the fact that you've been a moderator and a viewer on my YouTube streams for how long now and you still don't have a profile picture always entertains me. Yoga pants or sundress? You getting ready for a date or what? Did you change your picture? Or am I insane? I swear you had a different picture on here. Maybe I'm losing my mind. I know you changed it to that again recently. I know you had something else before. That's a woof. What are you stocking though? And stop, because I wonder if that was a winter color. It looked kind of light. I think it's gray. But, I bet you any red deer that are over here ain't gonna last, so... Try to get over here and see quick. Do you wanna look good? I think you should go with the yoga pants, man. You have the body. <laughs> Never mind. How was Easter? It was, uh... Memorable in the sense that it's the first time I ever spent Easter entirely pretty much on my own in my apartment. My mom actually brought Easter dinner here. So I got to like say hi, but that was about it. Couple of red deer. Oh, big male. Looking for melanistic, not necessarily looking for big males. How did I not see those though? I'm just going to shoot that guy, and we'll see what runs out. Just try to watch them all. Like I uh, mentioned earlier, I did see a YouTube video of somebody getting two of these, and they're quite obvious. Like, I feel like Melanistic Elk blend in to an extent. Like, they, they don't stand out nearly as well as I thought these did, so... If there's any here, we should see them. Got you, Vector. No worries. Some over here, apparently. Community stream, please. Can you ask them to make it so there's like two or three days of an event where everything in the shop is 100% free so anyone who can get what they want or need it? 
Uh, I feel like that would remove a lot of the early game fun, to be honest. One of the, like, I've restarted a couple of times, and one of the things that you look forward to is, like, getting that new scope or finally buying the 338 or whatever. Like, there's enough... You can kind of pay to win, in a sense, if you buy some of the DLCs that you can get the better weapons early. But I don't really see that as a necessary thing. Facecam vids ever? Yeah, maybe. Who knows? I don't feel like it adds a lot to Call of the Wild, personally. Maybe, though. You never know. How do you get this rifle, the M1 that I'm using? It's in the Smoke and Barrels weapon pack. Most recent one to come out. It's like four bucks. You got this, you got the muzzleloader, which is amazing. And you have the 10 gauge shotgun, which I have a video coming out on that this week as well. At least three cool kills. Did somebody ask about my face reveal? Yeah, I've got seven real-life hunting videos from this past season. I think six of them had my face in it. One of them, I'm pretty sure, was only narration, just because it was a less eventful week. Saw Melanistic Red Deer in that Harbor of the Seven. A couple of people said that. I don't think there was one. <laughs> we can come back here if we have to. How many hours do I have on the game? Uh, 2,700-something. It's a lot. I mean, I do play the game as my job, so I guess that makes sense. All right, we got we got red deers here. I ain't seeing no melanistic ones. Think I'm being lied to. But I'll still click on the serve veg anyway, just in case. They says common. You'll be back in the woods? Or are you saying you'll be back because you're currently in the woods? I'm not sure what you're saying, but I got you either way. No worries. Gotta run. Gonna take my little brother shooting in the backyard. Sounds fun. Catch you hopefully in another stream or something, man. Hey. I mean, I guess that wasn't completely smoking me. <laughs> I don't usually go that way. I never noticed that window before. Who said that? What? Hmm. Maybe they fixed the road here, or maybe a. I thought they drank five to nine as well. Is it six to nine? I don't know. Is a female level 3 springbuck rare? You don't see a ton of them, but they're certainly not rare. Any special boyos over here? Not really. Okay, we'll smoke the 7. Make absolutely certain I don't miss nothing. Another seven. Am I good enough at this? Nope. <laughs> just, just uh, patting the ego there. I see. Thanks. Uh, tips on diamond blacktail, shoot all the level 4s and 5s that have really wonky racks. Those are the ones that seem to be making diamond. That's about all I can tell you. Are heart shots easier in 2.0? I've actually kind of been wondering because I've been doing really well with it. I don't know if it's like maybe they've buffed weapons a bit. Maybe I've just been lucky, but... 
It does feel like I'm making a lot of consistent hard shots. Have you actually used your gallon of milk for physical therapy, though? Found the Easter egg yet? No, we tried for an hour on Layton. Uh, no luck. So I'm looking for Melanistic Red Deer, because that is a part of the Trailblazer beta. And I'm hoping, anyway, to run into... I'd love to find a stag, but any Melanistic Red Deer, to be honest. Hi. Killed a diamond gray wolf in a grizzly area? Where's that? Sounds interesting. You actually did? That's kind of epic, to be honest. I'm proud. Favorite DLC map? Uh, DLC map has got to be Verhunga. Favorite map in general? I mean, it should be Layton. I don't love what the true score has done to it. Elk were one of my favorite species, even after their true racks made them look bad. I still really liked hunting them and trying to find the fives because they look decent. But now they don't even make diamonds, so, like, I don't know. It's kind of sad. Uh, Zach Hunter, thanks for the super chat, man. Much appreciate. Cords, don't summon them. What are you doing? They're gonna come running. Here come, you know, whatever bots do. Not run. Out of every hundred animals, how many do I taxidermize? Uh, probably about one. I would say, because I don't shoot nearly as many things when I'm not streaming. So that plays a part in it. I would say when I'm just playing the game, not recording, not streaming, I taxidermize probably one out of ten. I probably shoot like nine animals that are either trolls that I don't taxidermize or things that I want for respawns. But when you factor in that I shoot like 30 animals every stream and a lot of times don't taxidermize anything, that kind of is a part of it. Uh, Young Mamba, thanks for the super chat, man. It's been a, been a while. What are we hunting? We're looking for Melanistic Red Deer. They're part of the Trailblazer beta. And I want to find some. Haven't found any yet, but we're looking. Aaron says he's easy, <laughs> I believe. Uh, Zach Hunter, thanks again, man. And always good to see the stickers and the super chats. I like those. But thank you, dude. I appreciate the support. Whoa deal. There's a red deer. Uh, is he melanistic? I think I see several. I thought I did. Nope, I saw sunlight. Uh, oh, I missed Warzone in there. Thank you as well, dude. I don't know what just killed the frames for a second. Something, something died. Uh. Small male. I feel like that trophy rating thing is going to help really determine what, like, level 2s have a chance of being diamond. Which, if the game's going to work that way, is a good thing. Bunch of woofs. Small woofs. Where's my red deer track? Was there another alert that I missed? Or was I just behind? I think I was just behind. Is freezing? Get your heated blank back out. It's you're just like hiding it. Ooh, big male. If this is a male, this got freak out. Ah, common. <laughs> Would have been cool though. There's a alert that I definitely haven't seen. Zach Hunter, thanks again, man. I really do appreciate you. Bunch of doggos. Yes, yeah, small doggos. Laptop is putting me in slow motion today for moderation. Is it as slideshow level as your stream was? 
or even better, does it have you 15 minutes behind? There's a huge one. Holy. They're all very common looking to me, though. Which, I mean, is a good thing. Like, I don't want to find a bunch of melanistics, but I'd like to run into one if we can get that lucky. Uh, who was that? I have to scroll up because I didn't get to see your name in time. Uh. Josh Acker, welcome to the members, man. I appreciate you. So, though, uh, if you don't know, you can get some uh, special rules and stuff over in Discord. So make sure you join Discord, link your uh, YouTube to your Discord so you can get the rules, all that good stuff. And yeah, enjoy your emojis and chat. Much appreciated, man. We got Zach Hunter with another super chat, I think. I'm not sure, but either way, you got another one in chat that hasn't <laughs> come up. There it is. And what zone? What map? We're on Quattro right now. But yeah, I appreciate you guys for all the support. Holy red deer. None that look out of the ordinary, but they're here. Are they buttered rolls? They're whatever rolls you would like. Just become a member, Aaron. You know you want to. Hi. Cinnamon rolls? Oh god, Gary's gonna break down the door. Oh, that does weird things. Why does it do that? That looks so looks so odd, Jay, but I appreciate you. I know you know the drill with uh, Link and everything up, but I appreciate you, man. Be sure to do that so you have access to the chat that you already have access to. How much money do I have? In the main game, I got to over 3 million monies just recently hunting geese. Um, probably in this one, 1 1.7 million because it's like an old save. Because Trailblazer beta. Trailblazer beta without melanistic red deer. Big sad. But we still have other places to check. We're going to go to this lake and also up to that one after that, so... We'll give that a look. Three mil. Yes. I'm getting close to 20,000 harvest because I've shot a lot of geese. I gotta pay attention to that because I want to get a diamond as my 20,000th, which will be interesting. I keep grabbing an empty water bottle. Someone help. How do you hunt geese? Um... I've got my setup. It's like the fields in Rathenfelt, they go north and then they start wrapping south. That furthest north field there, my setup's there and they seem to show up pretty consistently. Pigos. Small pigos. More pigos. I need a diamond one of these in the main game. Maybe Quattro. When do they feed? I'm going to. Pay attention to that. Till 7. Maybe Quattro Fields are the way to look for them, because the thing with Hirschfelden is it's a lot less open. I may actually go do that once this beta's over. Need help, but you're in Utah. No water. I have uh, I have my soda. Nah. <laughs> I, keep, I keep grabbing the empty water bottle. Because that's what I was drinking all morning. And for some reason, I refuse to replace the position that it's in. Which is why I keep grabbing it. Will I make a video trying to get a diamond blacktail? Probably. The thing is, it's just luck. You gotta get, like, a lucky level 4 with a wonky rack, essentially. How is what possible? I'm not sure what the question is. Uh, Warzone, thanks for the super chat. Can I do multiplayer? Probably not today. I mean, even if I did, it would be only for people that are on the Trailblazer beta. But I want to be able to check all these, uh, all these red deer lakes.
We gotta go, you know what? Let's look this side real quick. I see something. Slightly big male? Let me get a look at that, because its score estimate could be diamond. Check real quick, make sure nothing else. Okay. Does he have the diamond antlers? No. So I'm not going to bother. But I think generally the red deer drink like somewhere over there. So we'll go around this side. What are you talking about, Aaron? A big male gobbler, apparently. Shoost. Bye. A good Bethes Ibex spot. Show you the best spot. <laughs> this lake right here. There's an outpost literally there. I don't know if it's discovered on this safe, but tons of them go here. And also, if you're looking for diamond Bethes Ibex, the ones that are making diamond right now are the big fours. The fives don't seem to be. Which, uh... I really don't like, but... What do you do? Uh, Blitz Wapples, thanks for the super chat. Got your first diamond the other day? Nice, dude. Was it a... Black Buck? I don't know why I even guessed these, but... I'm guessing. How's it possible to shoot 20,000 geese? Oh no, I haven't shot 20,000 geese. I've shot 20,000 total animals in the game in the last, uh, mm, three plus years. Lots of hours, I can tell you that, but not 20,000 geese. Probably like two to three hundred in the last couple of weeks, though. Oh, God. Whew. <laughs> I thought that was a melanistic red deer. Yeah, I wish I could have seen the females. I don't know where they went. Kind of hoping if we keep going, we'll see them. One there. Rodeo. Do we get to see these ones? Not really. All right, then. We're still heading up here, so we might see them anyway. Do diamonds warning call? They will. Uh, less <laughs> less frequently than other, you know, smaller animals. They're more likely to just turn and flee without a call. But yeah, they will. Um, I have a video, actually. It's an old one of me trying to get a diamond while it was warning calling. Like, during the call, I had to take the shot. And I did it. I did it twice, actually, because I had a one glitch out on me and remove all my quick kill despite a hard shot. But yeah, they will. I has had it on video. Uh, Blitz Waffles, thanks again, man. Was it Gemsbuck? Ooh. Not bad, dude. Animals. <laughs> scared? Scared of what? Hi. I remember when I used to purposely shoot them in the head because I thought you had to when they first came out. That's entirely unnecessary. Anyway, uh, Zach Hunter, thanks again, man. I really do appreciate all the support. I like this color of European hair. It looks really good. Like, their backs are so realistic looking. Big fan. I need to just grind for a diamond one of those as well. I just need to figure out, like, where to do it. Does the cinematic tool for Call of the Wild not work anymore? I remember it used to, but now every time I try to load it up, it crashes. <laughs> yeah, um, I saw something about that posted in a Discord. Apparently, something is... There's like a conflict with it when it tries to launch the game, so it doesn't work. Which, for me, it's not a big deal. I tried to make thumbnails out of it, or with it, sometimes in the past, like when I didn't have a picture of a glitched animal. And I used it a lot for my um, choose your own hunt video I did in the past, but meh. It's not hard to get good screenshots of animals in this game, to be honest. That looked really cool for some reason, just that angle. 
Uh, Josh, thanks for the super chat, man. Happy to finally be a part of the army? Well, happy to have you, man. I appreciate you. They aren't even hard. Yeah, but it's because you don't have to shoot them in the lungs, Aaron. Smoked. Just got my first diamond. It was a lion. That's one of the more rare diamonds you can find, man. That's pretty cool. I need to play. It's been a while. Go hunt for... What should you hunt for? A diamond. No. Have you done the Hirschfeld missions? You should do those. I'm doing those this week. When is PA spring turkey season? May 2nd. It is so late this year. I don't like it. Uh, did we find anything yet? No. We're looking for melanistic red deer now. We spent an hour looking for any kind of unique whitetail, anything to uh, point us in the direction of the um, Easter egg, but a whole lot of nothing, so giving this a shot. Hirsch map is broken. Well, that's unfortunate. It's completely empty. Somebody's Verhunga on PC was like that. Like, I joined their map. And I ran around for like 20 minutes. And then they asked me, like, have I seen any animals? I'm like, no, it's weird. And he said, yeah, I can never find any. I don't think there's any on my map. I'm like, why are you hosting? <laughs> like, what am I doing here getting smoked? April 22nd. There's not even any turkeys in your state. And your season starts earlier. Makes me sad. First diamond was a level 9 gray wolf. Sweet. Just had one of those. Uh, finally on the new system like two days ago. Like right before I went to bed. What's up, TK? How's it going, man? I can't find your Easter eggs. I don't know where you hid them. How's Wyatt ever going to enjoy Easter if you hide Easter eggs this well? Those are not the red deer that I was hoping for. <laughs> I thought they were going to be red deer. Uh, who was that? I think it was Blitz Waffles again, right? Yeah. Welcome to the, uh, the Members Club. Should just start calling it that. The VIP Members Club, but I appreciate you, man. Make sure you join the Discord, link your YouTube to your Discord, so you can get the, uh, YouTube member rules over there. And enjoy the emojis and chat as well. I appreciate you, dude. Alright. Where are the red dude? Right there. Where are the melanistic red deer? I found a piebald on parquet yesterday, by the way. How stupid is that? <laughs> I'm looking for the rare fur variant that, like, hasn't been in the game or hasn't been spawning correctly. Naturally, I find a piebald. But no melanistics will probably smoke the one that I can't spot there. Hopefully... Guess I'm not gonna spot him. Are they melanistic? No. Are they ever? No. That guy doesn't even know what happened. I'll probably find like a melanistic roadie or something stupid. Just to add to my pain of finding the wrong rare red deer. Same, TK. Easter eggs are whitetail on Leighton? Yeah, it's supposed to be like the thickest of whitetail, I think is the most recent hint we got. I tried. I looked at all the white tail. There were no thick ones. I think TK's lying to us. There's actually nothing. He's just trying to lead us on till he does make the thing because he is in fact the one that codes the entire game. Totally him. Yeah, that was a mythical. Uh, that one Mouflon, wherever I was just spotting that guy. He's quite the large boy. 
No game, I would not like to spot him. Thank you. I'll just shoot him. Can probably get a long shot in there. Yeah. Did I get him? <laughs> I got a Mouflon anyway. Smooth. I think I just saw somebody say playing while watching just found a level 9 red deer. Get him. There's a big four. Small road deer. Decent four. Lots of stuff. When did I kill my first turkey? Um, Junior year of high school, I think. It was the day after, so our um, our junior and senior Spanish class got to go see a pirate game. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, the pirates are the baseball team from Pittsburgh. And they're like the closer baseball team in PA. There's the Phillies on the east side. Anyway, we would go to see the pirate game because my Spanish teacher was amazing and managed to like convince the academic whatever that... It was educational because one of, like, the big things for, like, baseball in general, there's a lot of, like, Spanish-speaking players. So, like, he managed to make that a thing. Anyway, we went to a pirate game. The next morning, I, I got home at, like, 1 a.m., got up at 5, and smoked a turkey. So it was one of those two years, but I think it was junior year. Why would someone want to go watch a Pirates game? I don't know, Aaron. Maybe some people aren't Fairweather fans. Just kidding. Uh, 179, so that's not even close. Anyway. I want to go here. Clint Hurdle can chew gum, though. Oh, yes, he can. And get fired. How long have I played Call of the Wild? I have been playing since its release. I believe it was like February 17th or something of 2017. I also got to actually beta test the game when they had the like two day open beta in early December of 2016. So even back then. Where in Yukon Valley do you recommend? It depends on what you're looking for, but the uh, Crimson Plain in the center is really good. Basically, the entire river in the east and south is amazing. Would start there. I could have sworn. I guess it was just like a particle. I thought I saw an albino rabbit go behind that bale. Some more rabbits. That one female's big. But not a three. You miss baseball? I don't really watch. Good time for Blacktail. They drink from 5 a.m. to 9 a.m. That's when I hunt them. They feed, I think... Uh, when do they feed? It's during Whitetail's drink time. Maybe they start around 1300. I'm actually not sure on that. But I always hunt them in their drink time in that early morning area. Oh my god, Brooke. <laughs> That's not okay. Which map is best for Red Deer? I still think Parquet is a little better than Quattro, but both those two are quite good. I prefer Parquet for the fact that it has um, Axis Deer and Mule Deer and stuff, though, I think, too, so that may be a part of it. Might not be exclusively the amount of Red Deer. We know where Brooks' mind is today. On average, how long with the new nervous state does it take for a fleeing animal to return to his zone? It depends, because they don't always uh, 
go back to the same place. Sometimes they, they'll turn around and come right back. Sometimes they'll take a long time and then they do actually come back to the same place. And sometimes they'll go to, you know, a couple hundred meters away and just like continue doing whatever they're doing in their zone. So I, I don't know that there's like a time I can give you or an average time or anything. It's just, it seems random. I imagine there's some kind of pattern to it, but if there is, I don't know what it is. How old is me? I'm 22. I don't want to alert these. The wind is bad, so I gotta walk. What if the zaggy... What if the zaggy deer is on Medved and TK is just lying? They're literally trying to keep us off the map by saying it's not on Medved. And we all just believed him blindly. I want to spot that one, but I can't. Bye. Yeah, he's a four. He's also dead. Which is, you know, useful at times. Any other big males hiding in there? Not really. Okay. What if the real great ones are the friends we made along the way? You're right. They're just trying to make us realize through merciless trolling. Where was he at? I just saw the blood. What direction was I facing? I know I saw it. Help. He literally dropped. How hard could this be? Should be... This way a little further, I think. There he is. Okay. What gun to use for Ibex and Mouflon? Uh, the 7mm, the M1, 30-06. Any of those will be quite effective. Alright. Last spot that I'm planning on checking for Red Deer. Can I use the 7 mil? I don't have it equipped, unfortunately. Choose my next diamond I should go for and rare. Uh, diamond... Let's see. I want to think of a good one. Diamond links. And I'll make it easy on you and put it on the same map. Rare... Highballed must deer look really cool, so maybe rare musk deer. Or try to get an albino brown bear. Because melanistic brown bear aren't really that much of a rare. They're fairly common. But albinos, they look cool. Are they working on something new? Yeah, there's a Trailblazer beta out right now for PC. Uh, so we can try to find whatever it is. There's also melanistic red deer should be spawning properly in the Trailblazer beta, and the one thing I will say is, I've seen a video on YouTube where somebody did get Melanistic Red Deer in this beta, so they exist, and the fact that I've gone to all these areas and not killed any so far, maybe means they are spawning correctly in the sense that there's not a ton of them. So I think that's good, but I'd like to find one still. Thoughts on adding silencers for me? I actually realized that there's a lot of European hunters that use them. So I understand, like, where a lot of people don't see any issue with it. I just don't want it to make the game any easier. I think the game is on the verge of being too easy at times. There's some things that I like the difficulty of, but I don't feel like we need to add that kind of help. Did I kill Mr. Black? I think I let him go because I didn't know what I was doing yet. I'm pretty sure I just let him walk. I didn't know I messed up. No way. Am I seeing that right or is that a red deer butt? 
I again. <laughs> I want a melanistic, not a piebald. Get off my map. Are you serious? Why? Or can I just have you in the main game? I haven't gotten a uh, a piebald female in the new system. I knew this was gonna happen. Where is that? Seriously, where did oh? Smoked. Um, Mav Dog, thanks for the super chat again, man. How's quarantine? Uh, you know, slowly losing my mind at things like that. But no, I mean, in general, it's pretty okay. Can survive. Put your head back down, sir. Put your head back down. There you go. I don't know how much him lifting his head when I went to shoot impacted that shot, but I'm sure it didn't help me. And that was too far back. Surprised you're at this lake. There's nothing ever there. I know. It's terrible. Should go to, like, the, uh... The... This lake. Where all the red deer are. But I already went there. You believe it's melon lipstick? I mean... It can be. I spooked all the mouflons. Darn it. That's alright. A bunch of them aren't really making diamond. Anyway. Piebald red deer. Been really consistent with our shots. I like that. But not what we need, so. Here's the thing. We got about 10 minutes left. I don't know where else I should look for red deer. But I am thinking of going to this lake because I find a lot of them. We're just going to have to go over the mountain. So we'll kind of see what happens. How many animals can you shoot in one area because of the hunting pressure? I mean, it's not going to stop you from shooting stuff. You're just going to delete zones. So, uh, three. If you shoot more than three, you're going to delete the zones. And you don't want to do that. Try to play hunting sim without cringing. That would be a heck of a challenge. Quite possibly impossible. Becoming the greatest for hunger hunter of all time till my game broke. Nah. I don't buy it. Don't even have an albino lion. An albino male lion, I should say. We need a 50,000 animal DLC and put an even amount on each map. That seems extreme. Ooh, we're not going to make it there in time. We'll change the time and try that again. Because they're going to be done drinking by the time we get there if we don't do that. So now we got to run an extra 300 meters, but that's all right. What is the Hunter Mobile? I haven't tried it out yet. I've seen some screenshots. It's essentially like most mobile hunting games as far as I can tell. You should do a video where your subs send and picks their favorite diamond and make a montage of it. I've thought about doing some kind of like thing like that. It would just be, like, a lot of stuff. I don't know that I would do a video. Maybe I would use, like, Twitter or something. But I don't know. Would have to think about it. Best place to hunt for Mouflon? They're pretty all over the place. I mean, this lake's really good for them. This top right lake has a lot. So does the one to the west of it. I find a lot of them, like, in this chunk of the map, too. And then even down here in the south where we're going. I do see them here as well.
What's my diamond count? 440 something. I, I'm on the Trailblazer beta, so I don't know. It's not going to give me the right one. The next herd will have a Melanistic. That'd be cool. I want it to. I want to just get to show you guys what they look like if you haven't seen them. But <sighs> just going to be all down to luck. Uh, Mavdog, thanks again, man. Do I like Fortnite? I've never played it. Not really a fan, personally. Got a case of the munchies. What did I miss? Uh, Piebald Red Deer instead of the Melanistic that I'm looking for. For the second time. Had that happen last night, too. Did I play Trophy Hunter 2003? I played... Was it... Rocky Mountain Trophy Hunter? What's the game, Gary? I played that one. No, it was just three, not 2003. <laughs> so no, I did not. Uh, Icy Cream, thanks for the super chat, man. Best map for beginners? Um, Layton or Parquet, I would say. Both of those have a lot of species you can take out, and they're rather easy to hunt. A real hunter plays fork knife. Steve Ranello plays fork knife. Can you tell me what exactly we should be looking for? The best of the hints that I know is whitetail that are over max weight. That's what TK posted in the hunter official discord. So look for that. Oh, wait, so that's the same series, Gary? I didn't know that. Have I ever played any of the old Cabela's games? Yeah, I've actually got a playthrough of Big Game Hunter 2004 season on this channel. I've got one more video I want to do on it, actually. I don't know if I'll get to it this week. I've got, like, a bunch of plans already. So maybe next week, maybe the week after, who knows. But I want to go back and improve a couple of the animals that we shot during that playthrough. Who's Max? How do we find out how much he weighs? That's what you gotta find out. That's the Easter egg. Go find him. They should have melanistic lions. Apparently they don't exist. That's what I've been told. Can I hear you? Yes. I can hear you faintly tapping on my window. Ever so daintily. First time it was an Iberian wolf from the story missions. Well, hey, you made the shot on it anyway. Overshot our light goal by five. Oh no. <laughs> this white tail weighs more than Max. No, he weighs the same as Max. Don't get it twisted. Uh, Mavdog, thanks again, man. Favorite animal in the game? I like reindeer, I like gray wolves. I like the Iberian wolves for the colors. Red deer, quite cool. I think reindeer, just because they're antlers. Yeah, I saw that, uh, Hunting Sim 2 thing. It's, it looked good, but... What the heck? Why does this look like ice? I mean, it looks cool, but I don't think that belongs there. Anyway, um, it looked good, but then, like, the animals didn't look like they had any improvements from Hunting Sim 1. Like, I I looked at some of that stuff, and it wasn't it wasn't impressive. McLemmy. Wait. I missed you. What did you say? You got tagged. Oh. I will beat you up for stinking so much at this game. No, you. You should give me your... I remember, like, you had a... I don't know if you messed them up or if you were missing consec or whatever, but there was a couple of diamonds that you, like, had chances on. And I was like, how does this kid even get lucky in Call of the Wild? But then I realized Call of the Wild's a little... Easier, it's just you were probably doing the right things before I knew how to do the right things. I 
I'm the reason I'm not. I mean, I'm not the reason. Nick Lemmy's the reason I'm not completely innocent. I mean, fairly accurate. The lucky hunter over here, let me tell you. How'd you get these binoculars? They're in the store, I think, level 27 ish. You unlocked them. Very useful, though. Much better than using the rangefinder. Whole lot of nothing really going down this mountainside, but I just want to get to this lake. Mess up like 10 to 15 diamonds somehow. I mean, the game just didn't make sense to us classic players. Like, I fell victim to the same issues I think you did, so I get it. It is like, what? what is quick kill? You shoot them and claim them. Good job, kids. Look at Aaron over here. Looks like he's conducting an orchestra. Do I ever do face cam? I use a camera in my real life hunting videos. I just don't feel like a face cam adds much to a hunting game. <laughs> like there's not, you know, jump scare reactions generally. There's been a few in like thousands of videos. I just don't feel like there's enough to warrant it. Uh, Dragos, I hope I'm saying that right. Thanks for the super chat, man. What's my go-to loadout? So right now it's been 300, M1, 243, and 22. I have been using the muzzleloader uh, in there as well, but the M1 for the range and the quick follow-up capabilities, it's quite good. I do really like it. Couple of red deer. Not seeing any melanistic yet, but they're still far enough away they're not all spawned in. I'm hoping, and then maybe there'll be another herd down on this end if we're really lucky. That's going to be the last we get to look at. <laughs> Aaron really is a fine conductor. I see how that's working now. What was that? Oh, a sheep. And a red deer that I spooked. Not melanistic. Okay. Um... Try to make sure we see stuff, but I feel like if there were any melanistics, we'd probably see them. Like I said, they stand out pretty well. And I see a whole lot of nothing special, so. I think we might be shoosting our last thing here. Hi. I want to test the theory real quick. Uh, I've had wolves attack me more when I'm facing away from them. So I'm just going to kind of run up through here a little bit. See if that works. I don't hear any attacky boys. No? Okay. But something I've been working on. It seems like it does work sometimes if you face away from them. They may have been two spooks since he had warning called already. But if I see a pack, I run like kind of close to them, and then I turn away from them and go, like, to the side or just straight away if I get close enough that they've stood up already. Seems like it can be effective. Okay. Um, we'll just shoot the stag. And I'll try to watch and make sure none of these look special. all common to me so no melon this red here but again like I don't know how much of a bad thing we want to take that as because that should mean they're fairly rare like I said I've seen videos of people getting them in this beta so they exist so hopefully they're not really easy to get because that's something I want to grind for I don't want it to be easy We need a full auto gun. I mean, we're getting closer and closer with this M1 being released. You know what I never did? I never tested the fire rate of this thing. Everybody cover your ears because I'm going to shoot this five times. <laughs> but, uh, I have never checked to see how fast it shoots. Not bad. No 22 pistol, but not bad. Do I like to fish? Yeah, I don't do it enough, to be honest, but I do enjoy it.
what do you think should come to Call of the Wild? I think it needs a new map next. Um, Quattro came out about six months ago. I th or no. Five months ago. Four or five. And we're, in my opinion, kind of badly needing another one, so... Hopefully soon-ish. By the way, somebody asked about how quickly animals return. These guys were already coming back. Just depends. Best place to shoot? Spine or heart? Um, I mean, heart's always ideal, but if you can get lungs, you're good. Oh boy, Gary. Enjoy that. We need the plains elk added? What's a plains elk? I'm not aware of this. Canada map? If it has pronghorn, I can accept this. We'd be alright with that. But anyway. We did kill a piebald red deer. I don't understand how... <laughs> the new thing happens and I get a piebald instead of the rare that's supposed to be there. As a, a new thing, but... Anyway. Like I said kind of good that we didn't get one in the sense that they should be actually rare which is nice and none of these woofs look any kind of special so we're not gonna worry too much but there's an alert so now we'll run this way for a minute it's an elk that lives on the plains well that <laughs> that makes sense Fair enough. Just gonna go get this zone because I don't think I got it. Later, John. I'm waiting for that alert to show up because for some reason it doesn't want to. There it is, Rebecca. Thanks for the super chat. Thanks for all that you do. Your videos are amazing. Well, thanks. I really appreciate that. And, uh, I don't know. I enjoy it, so. Hopefully, win-win for everybody. But, with that, I think we're going to be wrapping up this stream. So, yeah. I've got some videos that I mentioned already during the course of the stream coming this week that I'm pretty excited about. So, hopefully I can see you guys in those videos. But, uh, yeah. Thanks again for hanging out. And I'll see you hopefully then. Bye!